Hey everybody, welcome to Texas Game Hunters. Today we're gonna show you the new ATN Laser Ballistics. We have the ATN Laser Ballistics 1500 here, and we're gonna show you how it interacts with the ATN Excite 2. It's gonna act the same with all ATN Smart HD products. So the 5x20, the 3x14, the Thor HD series, all it's gonna react the same. So uh, we, got our, we got our scope hooked up to an actual HD TV for a 100% live feed so you can see what you would see looking through the scope. Uh, so stay tuned. I'm Joseph Truesdale. This is TXGameHunters.com. This portion of Texas Game Hunters is brought to you by ATN, the future of optics. OD Green Gun Oil. If you love them, keep them lubed. Magnetic Force Holsters, the perfect holster for any situation. Sniper Hog Lights, light up the night with the original Sniper Hog Light. Nightvisionuniverse.com, let us be your eyes in the night. Mormon Taxidermy, your best choice for taxidermy in Texas, period. All right, so the first thing you want to do is you want to make sure your Bluetooth is on, which is you're going to go over to where your Wi-Fi, you scroll down, GPS, Bluetooth, it is on because there's no line through it, so it is on. And I'm going to go ahead and turn my ballistic calculator on as well. The next thing you want to do is go to settings scroll over all the way to settings scroll down scroll down to Wi-Fi and Bluetooth and where it says uh, rangefinder click on that and you want to pair or unpair I am paired so I'm going to leave it as paired but you would select pair to pair it up with your rangefinder exit out all right so now the next thing you want to do is you want to turn on your rangefinder by pressing the power button when you do that this is what you're gonna see you're gonna see the yardage right there or you can switch through different modes so you have a fog mode and an angle mode and then your regular yardage. You can press and hold the mode button to switch to meters. Press and hold it back to switch back to yardage. So that's what you're gonna see when you turn it on. All right, so the next thing you wanna do, your ballistic calculator's on, hit exit. So you're gonna come out of your screen and you're gonna see right here at the bottom of your screen this is your ballistic calculator. Right now we have the wind set to zero and at 94 yards it's moving our reticle up 0 0.06 inches. So very, very small amount. All right, we're gonna take the range finder. We're gonna point at the 50 yard marker and range it. That's actually 44 yards. When you see the range finder zoom, now this changed to 44 yards. Now it moves my reticle to 1.08 inches. Still the windage is left to right zero because we have no wind entered into the system. So let's go back to 100 yards. Maybe. All right, range finder out. Out to 100 yards, 111 yards, 99 yards, 98 yards. Changes it, right, because that's where we have it zeroed in. So it's going to be a very, very, very minute change. So now, let's see if I can hit the 200 yard marker. I had that at 222 yards 
and so you see it change here 222 yards and it changed my reticle 3.11 inches for 222 yards so that is the ATM ballistic calculator in a nutshell with and paired with the range finder now one more important thing you want to go over to your profiles and for your current profile you want to make sure you have everything set up correctly for your for your round of ammunition and the round that we're using is the American Eagle Varmint and Predator uh, full uh, it's the jacketed hollow point 50 grains and and let's actually I didn't set it up so let's set it up it's 3325 30 3 20 1 2 3 4 5 zeroed in the sight height is correct and we're at 50 grains correct we're using 50 grains yeah 50 grains and let's get our ballistic coefficient which is on their website I believe we have the caliber 223 ballistics the bullet style is a jacketed hollow point bullet weight 50 G1 ballistic coefficient of point 204 muzzle velocity 3325 so we set everything up correctly on here uh, except for the muzzle velocity which we just corrected so we are good to fire that wind is howling let's see what that wind current, current wind is here the weather channel app wind is east from nine miles an hour east so let's go to our environment relative humidity is 91 percent all this is going to affect your let's see how the wind speed does we're going to do a constant it's like an eight mile an hour eight mile an hour wind from the east and it already pulls the uh, temperature barometric pressure and the altitude All right, so now it says at 222 yards, it's going to move my reticle to the left 4.4 inches because that's a straight crosswind coming across here. 110 yards, changed it right there. So let's actually take a shot. So, I think we're dead on with the ballistic calculator, accounting for the wind and everything. All right, so let's switch it to 50 yards. So, without changing the ballistics, let's see where we're at at 50 yards. So, hair low. Let's go ahead and hit it with the rangefinder. All right, 43 yards. Change it up here. It moved our windage and our in our inch up so let's see where we're at now all right definitely changed a little bit and we're good all right so now for a big test let's go out to 200 223 yards see it changed everything a lot so now let's see, let's see what it does. We'll do two shots and then we'll check it out with the camera. Looks like we're gonna have to walk out there in the rain. All right, so we got two. All right, so we got two right here without the ballistic calculator, and two with the windage and the ballistic calculator. So 224 yards, the wind does a pretty good job. We said so. 
if you do not have an ATN scope, which I don't know why you don't, you should get one, but if you don't, you can download this app, the ATN uh, Ballistics app, from the Android store or the Apple store, and you can connect to your phone via Bluetooth, uh, and then you laser, when you, once you put all your ballistics into your phone, into the app, then you laser the target, the Bluetooth it feeds the distance via Bluetooth to your app, and then it auto and then it tells you how many clicks for your elevation and your windage to turn your scope to make that that distance shot. So you don't you can get this and use it with your traditional scope. You don't have to have an ATN product. If you uh, the 1500 model does retail for $350. The 1,000 meter model retails for 279. Uh, get one if you don't, because this is the easiest rangefinder I've had so far, and and, and I've, I've I've spent a hundred dollars on those 400 yard rangefinders, and then half the time it doesn't work past 200 yards, or it takes you five times to 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 laser a target. You saw the real time how you could just hold the button and move the range finder around and it lasered and told you the distance in real time as you're moving the the ballistic or I mean as you're moving the range finder around so get this add it to your arsenal you will not be sorry